All right, Diesel Talk with Tony Salas here with Beto. He's back, guess what, he's back. Um, doing a 6.7 liter, he's putting everything back together here. Anyways, the point I wanted to talk to you guys real quickly about 6.7 CP4 pump. You all know about the CP4 pump, right? So there's this guy, boy, this guy has a bad name, doesn't he? Okay, real quickly, SNS is marketing a pump replacement for that. Well, let's get one thing clear. That's a standard iron pump used mostly in the Asian market, as far as I know, and it's not used on V8 applications. So if it is, it hasn't been proven or shown. So therefore, those of you who are jumping the gun, ready to go ahead and put in a new pump that's not original, such as the CP4 I just showed you, I always keep in mind what kills the CP4 is actually low lift pump pressure and volume. So therefore, when you change those fuel filters, you wanna make sure you go ahead and run the truck at least 15 minutes after you replace the fuel filters to make sure all air is worked out. So that'll again, lengthen the life of that CP4 pump. So be aware of being jumping the gun and, and burning money on an unproven pump. So therefore the CP4, you might say things about it, but this truck right here has 160,000 miles still on the original pump. And we got other six sevens with the original pump. Something to keep in mind.